So your store is up and running, and you're ready to make some edits, but you're not sure how. We're here to help guide you through the process. We'll go over 1. How to navigate the dashboard 2. How to use Shopify's theme customizer 3. How to create and edit pages 4. How to create and edit blog posts 5. How to alter header and footer links 6. The importance of your theme files and 7. How to use apps in Shopify, all edits begin on the admin dashboard. The dashboard is an overview of your site. In the center, you will see a number of analytics displaying detailed data about your site. On the left sidebar, you can navigate through the back end of your site and interact with data associated with products, collections, shipping information, and store details. We'll start with your theme. Your theme is the layout, the design, the functionality of your website, and how your site will display data to your customers. It's the skin of your site and how most people will recognize it. A quick and easy way to customize your theme content and settings is to use Shopify's Theme Customizer. This will include a theme preview and menus to make changes to your theme settings and to add, remove, edit, and rearrange content. If you'd like to utilize this functionality, go to Online Store, then Themes, and click the green Customize button to begin. While the primary purpose of an e-commerce site is the store, there are a number of auxiliary pages that you will want and need. These include things like an FAQ page or an About Us page. If you'd like to add a page to your site or edit an existing page, locate the Online Store tab on the left-hand sidebar. Next, go to Pages, and here you can add or select a page to edit. If you are looking for a specific page, use the search bar at the top left and search for the page you are looking for. Click on it to begin editing. Make the changes you want and click Save. If you want to add a new page, go back to the page list and click the Add Page button at the top right. Having a blog on your site is a great way to speak regularly to your customers about the happenings in your industry. If your site has a blog and you'd like to locate, alter, or add a new blog post, begin at the Admin Dashboard and locate the Online Store tab on the left-hand sidebar. After landing on the Online Store tab, click into the Blog tab to begin editing. It's also important to your customers that they are able to find the pages that they are looking for. These are typically found in the header and footer links at the top and bottom of your website. To make items appear in your header and footer, like your About Us page or your FAQ page, you'll want to add them to your navigation. To do that, go to Online Store and then click Navigation. Here you can add links to your header and footer menus. One of the most important parts of your site are the theme files. Your theme files are where the HTML, JavaScript, and other code of your theme are stored. Your theme files can be found by going to Online Store, then Themes. Locate the Action drop-down menu and select Edit Code. Theme files are very important and altering them affects your whole site. You should proceed with caution when altering them. Apps extend the functionality of the website by providing features that are not native to Shopify. We leverage apps in most of our builds. If you want to interact with apps or adjust their setup, you can do so by clicking Apps from the dashboard menu, then navigating to the app you want to look at. It's worth noting that not all apps work with all themes, some apps slow down websites, and it's easy to install more apps than you really need. Some apps also require custom installation from a developer. So before installing a new app, ask yourself if you really need it and reach out to your account manager to see if we can recommend something. Now you're ready to start running your Shopify store. If you have questions, reach out to your account manager and they'll set you down the right path. If you want to know more about the specific functionality of something we build, other great resources include help.shopify.com, which offers articles and how-tos on using Shopify. Similarly, the Shopify forums, community.shopify.com, is an active community of Shopify developers and store owners like you. You can also reach out to our client success manager to keep your site on the cutting edge. And those are the basics of how to navigate editing your site. This is your site, and we want to encourage you to make changes to make it your own and edit as needed. Just remain cautious when making edits and feel free to reach out to us when you prefer us to make edits for you. 
We hope you are having fun exploring your new site and thank you for working with Arctic Leaf.